I originally fell, I was done. I was telling my mom I never wanted to step back on the ice again. I was tired of injuries. I did not want to fight back from another one. I thought that was just the final sign saying you were not meant to be in this sport. Skating was really scary for me when I came back. I didn't know if I wanted to do it again. I was scared to put my skates on. I was scared to get on the ice. And once I finally got on the ice, I was scared to be on the ice with other people. And then there was the fear of competing again and putting myself in front of the crowd again and being in front of judges again. It all scared me in a number of ways that I never felt towards skating ever in my life. I was never scared of trying new things. I was never scared of falling or running into someone on the ice. I just, I was so fearless on the ice and then it switched so quickly. So I had to overcome a lot of that and definitely I still feel a little nerves if someone gets a little too close on the ice or if I'm up in the air and I know I'm not gonna land on my feet. It, I still have that fear, but it's a little, it's a lot less. <laughs> I did have to relearn how to skate from the basics and it wasn't until the end of the year when I finally had a good skating competition that I realized I was like I can actually get back to where I was if not better and I just actually had to put the work in and I knew that I was skating three hours every day and I was just tired of going through the motions of it and after that moment I went to the rink with a purpose every day instead of just skating.